Patterson. I just want to welcome you on behalf of Win Forever, uh, Nike, Coach Carroll. We're at the football offices of TCU in Fort Worth, Texas. I really didn't know what to expect when I got here. I was expecting the same X's and O's type clinic, but it's really self-development. See what I need to work on as a coach? I didn't envision what I was going to learn tonight. I really didn't. You are the new generation of coaches for the next generation of athletes. We just started doing this around the country. What's our mission? Maximize your potential. And how are we going to do it? We're going to try to do things better than they've ever been done before. Raise your hand if you love winning. Of course we love winning. We, we love being around the game. How many guys, raise your hand right now, can stand up and tell us in 25 words or less what your philosophy is? One guy. Don't you think it would help if you had a philosophy that represented who you are and what you're all about tonight? We're going to start that process for you. Your coach philosophy is just basically how you handle situations on a daily basis. It's about winning individually with each kid. It's a system that can allow you to develop an approach to coaching, to life, to mentoring. you got to be willing to do the work to figure you out. What are some of your uncompromising principles? All you got to do is put them down in that book. Just write them down. Coach Carroll started talking and giving us some goods and bads and things that he had done. After the Coach Wooden moment, it came to me, you know, I'm a competitor. We are in a relentless pursuit of a competitive edge in everything we do in our program. You're either competing or you're not. Everything that we stand for is to teach our players that competition is going to take them to the heights of what they can become. It's about being the very best you can possibly be. If we're working at that, we're winning. It's about making a difference. The whole philosophy of your game, how you're going to talk to your players, the other side of football. I can teach my players, this is what we look like, this is who we are. When you get to the core of what you believe, you become more powerful. Like the lighthouse. That light just keeps shining. Everybody around you is going to feel it. How do you take your team through this approach and a philosophy? Training, practice, we can give you 365 days a year to perform in the absence of fear. You're not going to play forever. you got to compete and do the right things in life, be a good dad, be a good parent, be a good teacher. For having success off the field and on the field. 480 hours a year you average with your student athletes. Man, think about it, that's a lot of time. 21.8 million kids in the United States under the age of 21 play sports. A fourth of them have single parents. Wow, 84% of them are moms. I'm not saying they don't do a great job, but look at your role. It is massive. I was actually intimidated being around all these uh, college and pro coaches, but that they were down to earth. You have a set vision, set philosophy, I mean, it relates to any level. Coach is coaching. I think that's the great thing about Coach Carroll. It's awesome to see him doing it on the NFL level as well. We are never going to give the football away because it is the most important element of us winning football games. Whatever it takes, we never stop. We keep moving. Getting the athletes on the balls of their feet. Stay in the moment. Stay present. That's the whole point of peak performance. A unified team vision. It's up to you to build those connections. On every team. It's a numbers game. It's the largest database in the history of the game. We're talking about competition, we're going to go out and have a heck of a practice. Better win forever practice. A phrase we'll use is, if you're walking, you're wrong. There we go. <laughs> oh. I think it's always great to kind of rattle the cages a little bit. What if I gave you $500? Would you do it? Show me the money. <laughs> <laughs> go, let's go, go, go. Oh, oh, oh baby. Oh, it's oh, over. Oh, nice job. <laughs> new generation coach I mean that's just you're setting a bar for future generations of coaches we don't have a lot of opportunities as coaches to go to workshops that actually focus on the intangibles of coaching like we did tonight and and to me as a head coach that was awesome it's absolutely phenomenal I mean I'd recommend to anybody coaching wants to be a coach definitely worth a trip up here but hopefully it continues to grow I mean this is just so critical and so important and so 
vital to society and success on the football field is a small part of it. Success in life is the, is the best byproduct of it. You know, I can go a lot of places and learn X's and O's, but the things that we learned tonight, I'm a better coach right now than I was four hours ago, I know that.